There's always that one person that will always have your heart. You never see it coming cause you're blinded from the start. Know that you're that one for me. It's clear for everyone to see. Oh, baby. You gotta rock me way to Okay. Hi, <laughs> YouTube. It's Christina. And Ronald. And Ronald. Yes. We are here live. Live. For our 17th week. Wow, you had to think about that? No. I knew how far along I was. <laughs> this is our 17th week pregnancy vlog. vlog with a V. Not a blog, but a vlog. Yes. I find myself typing it in on YouTube sometimes, <clears throat> and YouTube tries to correct me and say blog instead of vlog, but it's actually a video vlog, not a blog. A blog is where you go and write. Just an FYI to the people. Letting folks know. Letting them know. Loving it, loving it, loving it. Anyway, how have you been feeling, Miss uh, Prego? I have been great. Are you still sick? Do I still sound sick? Not so much. I'm getting a lot better. Maybe I won't say I'm a hundred percent. Let's say ninety-eight point six. Sounds like a nice random number. Yeah. I'm cool. Um still a little snuff stuffiness going on up in the nostril region. It's to been, be expected though. Been doing some no, I would say saline drops. That's what my doctor told me. I should try. But I've been like gargling salt water and, you know, doing the vaporizing thing and rubbing vaporizing stuff on my chest and trying to clear it up. Still taking those good old Tylenols. Those good old prenatals. And those good old prenatals. I told you guys I had him make, I made him try one one day, right? Yeah, it sucked. It sucked. Now he knows how I feel. I've been good though. My mouth still hurts, which I guess, you know, attribution to being pregnant. I guess I have to live with it for about six more months. Something like that. Something like that. But otherwise, I've been good. It was I was coming, I was going to say great, but good came out. So <laughs> good. That type of thing. How have you been? Pretty good. Just chillaxing, working. Uh, we've been we've been working on the baby's room. Getting, Still working. Yep, getting some stuff out of there and doing some demolition. Yep, demolition. That's what it is. Demolishing things. Yesterday was pretty exciting, though. No? Yesterday was exciting. We went to Decray and Larea's baby shower. Hope you guys had a good time. Hope everybody did it. Went had a good time. It was awesome. We had a good time. Yes, we did. The cake was awesome. The food was awesome. The people were awesome. I wish I took cake home. Decray and Larea. You guys are awesome. Baby Leilani. Leilani. Yes. Beautiful. We love you. What did you. he say? It's Hawaiian. <laughs> I think he said for Heavenly Father. I mean, flower? Yeah, Heavenly Father. I didn't mean Father. Flower. <laughs> flower. I mean, like I said, still a little tongue twisted. But that was yesterday. That was not... She got on paper. She got all the uh, clips yesterday. I did win a few games. They played the... Uh, the game where you can't say certain things. So, of course, they were having a girl, so you couldn't say girl or baby. So, I won. That was awesome. I won. They got a lot of nice gifts, and they, did. they were really happy. We were happy to they see them were. happy. We were. Yes. Ooh, Excuse me. But we've been good. That's an exciting thing. We're excited for their baby to arrive. Yeah, they got about another 10 days or so to go. Maybe we can babysit practice like, no, I'm just kidding no. anytime guys anytime <laughs> but that's that um we told you guys we'd be back didn't have you waiting a whole three weeks again right we did good we did good we did go to our doctor's appointment yes we did we that got to hear the baby's heartbeat again he got to hear the baby's heartbeat for the first time yes was... what was it Awesome. What, the baby's heartbeat? Do you remember? It was like 160. It was 160. Guys, you know, that's the uh, the old wives tale. If it's over 140, it's a girl. Under 140, it's a boy. Has Let that been know. true for you guys? Let us know down bottom. 
That is snow. I'm rocking my Snuggie. It keeps me warm at night. <laughs> I love it. But yeah, guys, I, I want to know about that one. So, because that means we'll be having a girl. Maybe so. I think so. Um, What else? I've been getting some reading done. I'm almost finished my book. The Expectant Father book that I showed you guys in my week one, I believe. Week one? Oh, well, it was week eight, but video one. Yeah, week one, but video... Week eight, video <laughs> one, whatever. <laughs> But uh, I almost finished a book. Um, Me too. I'm almost finished my book. Um, the book is, is pretty informative. <laughs> uh, it pretty much like I'm, yes. I'm pretty much like on a labor and delivery, and it gives you like every scenario from you know regular natural birth to C sections to if you're trapped in the cave. Trapped and in a cave. Who would be trapped in a cave? You need to Not me. assist your partner trapped in a cave delivering a baby you might need to assist me with more than that if i'm trapped <laughs> in a cave. problems mental problems but the book is really awesome um i have maybe two or three more chapters and i'll just be using it for a reference guide a reference. but have you been feeling any more fluttering or i haven't I felt it that one day, and I guess Sunday. that was it. Then the baby ran away. But like I said, we went to the doctors. The doctor said, the "Doctor said I was doing great, you know," and it was reassuring. She know. made it sound really reassuring. Like doctors, you know, I usually go to the office, and they're like, "Everything's, Everything's good, good, you know, whatever." Like, like my blood levels were good. She just she seemed like impressed. I, I don't know, like, like I don't know. Yeah. But I was happy to hear that. I did the second part of the sequential screening, so we will be waiting for... It's been a week. We haven't heard anything, so they, I assume that means... They said if you didn't hear, if we didn't hear anything, then that meant good, so... That meant good. Good. That means we're good. Yes. Baby's good. Yes. Baby is like seven... Seven... Seven, seven something. I didn't remember that. In the in the um in our little app on our phone, I don't remember that. It said baby's growing. It's like doubled in size. It still we looks a little funny, got some furniture too. We did. We got a crib and a changing table and the changing table. They're both awesome. They look really nice. They do. They do. Yeah. They do. They do. So we're just. Gradually grabbing things and kind of like storing them in another room. And then once we get finished with baby's room, then we'll... Move them all in. Yeah. I'm ready to put the crib together just to see what it looks like. Yes. But I don't think I'll do it. She, she'll end up doing it while I'm like at work or something. Guys, why is everyone treating me like I'm handicapped? Like I can't pick anything up. Not everybody. Like I can't do anything. Like, I can't touch anything. Like, I can't be anywhere. I just say don't lift nothing heavy. heavy. Like, this mouse no. is too heavy. No. Would you like to hold it for me? Yeah, I'll hold it for you. Thank you so much. Our friend just did a retreat and I liked it, that, so she just kind of felt yeah. like somebody was treating it like, um, I don't know. Not something I want to say on YouTube. Like an incurable disease. <laughs> but I'm not that. But um, we're pretty excited, though. We go back to the doctor on February 7th. On the 7th. And pretty By much... By then, we should know what the sex of this baby is. We should. Because we're going to try to schedule that. Did you call to make that appointment? No. I told you when I called for the sequential screening, I got my appointment the next day. Well, maybe a lot of people try to figure out what their baby is the same day we go. So maybe you should try to schedule it. Maybe. But they can't do it until we're 20 weeks. She'll work on it. You can schedule it anyway. Okay. Um, <laughs> wow. We've just been chilling, though, watching movies. We saw a Black Swan today. Black Swan. We watched... Um, a runaway Train or... Unstoppable. Unstoppable, whatever the crap was. Yeah, that was pretty good. We were on our movie hiatus today. Yeah. Pretty good. Pretty, pretty, pretty cool. Then we got a chance to watch a little bit of the Patriots get their I didn't behind spanked. Ha ha, Duran and Dante. Ha ha. Ha ha. 
Maybe we should talk more about the baby. Maybe we should. I don't know what to talk about there. Um, just how should you we feeling? Should we pick for names? No. Not yet. No. Still a secret. No, they won't know till the baby gets here. Oh day. Oh day. But you have anything else? No, I said I feel I feel bad because I feel good. Is that bad? No. I feel bad that I feel good, but that's good, not bad. You feel good. That feels good to me, and that's good. Okay. Because, like, I feel like I should have things to talk about. Yeah, 17 weeks means I'm almost... Bah. Means we're almost halfway through the pregnancy. So do things go up? Or do they start going down? Apparently, some people seem to think that, it's, that she's going to get sick, but I don't mm. think so. I think she'll... She's going to be a trooper throughout the rest of this. Trooper. Yeah. You have a lot of high expectations. A lot of faith. Faith. But. I like it. We're not going to hold you up if she doesn't have anything else to talk I about. I don't have anything to talk about. And we. Everything's still the same. We'll see them next week. Same time. Same place. Peace. Ugh.